Hey everybody and welcome to Lex's Lounge. Today I wanted to talk about uh, picking value stocks and the rationale by which I find them. I'm going to use Home Capital Group as an example, which is a recent uh, good investment I made. Looking at Home Capital Group at their five-year chart, this is a Canadian mortgage and financials company that uh, has had a bit of a rough time. In 2014, they peaked out at $55 a share and over a couple years slowly bled out to about 25 bucks a share. Uh, while at the same time, they did try to keep up their dividends, um, but then in the last three months here, in April, they had a sudden drop uh, from about 22 bucks a share all the way down to at one moment 5.99 a share uh, because clients came in were trying to take their money out of the company it was in really a lot of trouble and i at that point i looked at the company after that fast drop and i noticed that in the days after the drop there was still volume of trading going on which means traders were interested in the company and i also did some reading to try and figure out whether the problems of the company were permanent or potentially temporary. And what I found was they were potentially very temporary and to some degree would get resolved in the next few months. So right around May 6th or May 7th here, uh, actually I think closer to May 8th, I bought some shares for approximately $9 and the company started to recover. And before I knew it, uh, it had recovered to uh, 15 bucks and I was able to get rid of half my shares at a 50% gain. Now, how did I know this company was really, really cheap when I bought it? Well, I looked at the price to earnings ratio and it was at about 3.0, which is crazy cheap for a financial stock. So I figured, man, at 3.0, unless this company goes belly up, um, that is really, really cheap. The last time the shares were that cheap, um, in terms of dollar values, uh, was way back at the peak of the 2008 crash. So anyway, then in the past month here, there's been another gap upwards for my remaining shares. And the reason for that is famed uh, value investor Warren Buffett. Uh, it turned out he bought $400 million in this company, which, uh, as you guys can tell right here, market cap $1.6 a $400 million investment in it is pretty serious. As well, he extended them a substantial loan to help them get out of trouble. And now we got another volume spike down here as the stock reacts, and the remaining 50% shares I have are heading even higher. So there you go, guys. That is how you look for value plays in a generally overvalued market. You find companies that uh, have had some struggles. You catch them in a bad moment, meaning a moment so bad that they're on the front page of the news, or at least the front page of the financial section. And you do an analysis as to whether their situation is recoverable or not. And uh, yeah, that is how you make value plays. In the description, I will link to the chart of the stock so you guys can peruse it yourself and get a feel for it. And uh, other than that, subscribe and hit that like button. And we'll see you next time on Lex's Lounge.